We got GPS on a 1952 Oliver 88. Today we have a new addition for our sprayer that I'm super excited about. Take a look at this thing. So this is the unit right here. It is on track by AgRecision. It's a really cool little deal. It allows you to connect this unit to an Apple or Android tablet or phone, whatever you'd, unit you'd like to use to this without using any cell service and it'll give you GPS signals to put you in straight lines down your field. So all that actually comes in this box is the AgRecision on track unit itself as well as a charging cable. But besides that, it's pretty much just this guy. It's super simple. This is what actually receives the GPS and then it transmits via Bluetooth to your tablet what you're using and shows you how left or right of the line you are. It also has a display on this. The big center line right in the middle right there lights up green. That lets you know that you're online. Then everyone else off to the left and right, there's a couple on each side of this guy, those light up red. That tells you if you're too far left or if you're too far right. We're gonna go mount this guy up to the hood. I've yet to use it. All I've done is download the app. Let's see how this goes. As far as installing the unit on the actual tractor, the bottom is magnetic. You set it on the hood. It clicks down really nice. You center it up as best you can with where you would consider the center of your hood or what you wanna be considered as dead center. You hit the power button. That guy turns on and you head back over inside your cab and take a look at your tablet. Now that we're inside the cab, we're gonna go to our AgRecision app, which is right there, already downloaded for us. We can see right there, it popped up really quick and told us that it was connecting to the OnTrack device. Up here, it shows that we do have a Bluetooth connection to our OnTrack and it's at 99% charged. If that doesn't show up, you're gonna to go to your Bluetooth settings, go through there and find it just like you were connecting a pair of headphones or a speaker. So now that we know that this is communicating with that guy up there. We're gonna go set an AB line and see how accurate it is. So we have a fairly nice straight road right here. We're gonna go ahead and set our A point. And now what we're gonna to need to do is drive ahead a little bit. And so the A point has been set and we get down a little ways and now we're gonna select our B point. And now you can see right there, those are our lines that have been positioned throughout the field. So if you look down here, I hope you can see it, but we have a green light. That means that we're heading nice and straight. That means that we're on line. If I start steering to the right too much, those red lights come on on my right side. That's telling me to get back over. If the red light pops up on the right side, that means go left. If the red light pops up on the left side, that means go right. So we're cruising in line here for the most part. Let's say I wanna start mapping my acreage, my covered acres, you're just gonna tap the screen. That's gonna pull up your coverage map. I have it set for 60 feet right now because this sprayer has a 60 foot boom. And that's how that works. That records the amount of marked acres. So the amount of acreage that you are actually marking on the screen. And I've heard from online sources that it's not 100% accurate, but it's very close. Gives you a very good estimate. As you can see, that green light is super visible from the cab. Maybe you guys can't see it, but I can see it very easily. This is going to make spraying in wide open fields such as this rye field so much easier with a sprayer. And now I'm gonna do something that I've wanted to do ever since we got this thing in the mail, and that is putting GPS on our 1952 Oliver 88 row crop. Let's give her a shot. And this right here is why Oliver is the best tractor money can buy. Even in 1952, the engineers made the battery box double as an iPad mount. That is ingenuity. So we're gonna do the exact same thing before. We're gonna go in here and set our new A point right there. We're gonna drive ahead a little bit. And then we're gonna mark our B point. And look at that. We got GPS 
1952 Oliver 88. To be honest, I came up with this whole throwing the GPS unit on this year Oliver 88 is a joke. I did not think for one second that it'd be serious. I was like, where would the iPad go? It just wouldn't work that great. The iPad fits in that battery box perfectly, absolutely perfectly. Unit straddles the radiator cap perfectly. This thing has hydraulics and PTO. I think this is our new seed drill tractor. I really do. Absolutely beautiful. As always, guys, thanks for watching.